Um. All right. I'm fast to 16. Where did we leave off in this? We talked to Jill, and we're going back to Phoenix Gate, I think, with her. Yes, yes, that's what's happening. Well, we gotta speak with Karen first, I guess. Let's get this fixed before someone. Yes, hello. What do you want? I, I don't to remember. Say farewell. Okay. We're leaving. Good decision. Better that than buried out there in the black. You've got a lot to thank that girl for, you know. I know. And I will. Now, what do you really want? We both know that you don't come here for conversation. Um... Guy a Blade. See, like... This is already better than the Stormcry Sword. I'm not feeling this weapon upgrade system. Much more and like money is not a problem. Anyhow. You're rubbing me blind, you know. It's hold out. Breath of the wind. Um, I don't I don't have that unlocked yet. I'm just, I'm just gonna hang on to these. If I need money, we'll sell Off it. Off you go, then. I'm best of luck. I should probably say thank you to Gav, too. This looks like, um... Ramu's sword, Sid's sword. I see I'm busy here. So will it be? I would like a guy blade plus one, please, for more damage. So I'm confused. So I can craft a guy blade plus one, or I can reinforce one. I had two more valley matters. So like I didn't have to buy one. I'm I don't I don't like it. I should I should have talked to him first to make one. I think is how I am reading this. Which is Whatever, man. Um, sure. Make that level two. Yeah, One, whatever. Oh, uh, sure. Make it level two. Not my best work, but it'll do. It'll do. Unless the run is free, yeah. I mean, yeah, there's a lot of that, too. They're just like, oh, well, I rolled a one instead of a six. It's not my fault. You can thank me later. Do my best work, but it'll do. Sure. I, so far, I'm not enjoying the upgrade system in this game. I trust you're settling in? Nope, we're leaving. Getting used to the place. I'm glad to hear it. I was hoping you might be persuaded to come to my aid once more. Your services will be rewarded, of course. I don't doubt it. Seems to be the way around here. We strive to be better than those we once served. Now, as to the task itself, 
I am once again in need of a pair of hands to deliver sustenance to our esteemed companions. I have three meals for three industrious souls. What say you? Sure. I'd be happy to help. Marvelous. The three individuals you'll be seeking out are busying themselves about the hideaway. You'll find one by the entrance, another in the bunks, and the other guarding the cells. Thank you once again, Clive. Partner push. Yeah, that makes it even more awkward, I guess. Yeah. I just don't have enough teams to follow every lead. No. Teams of one. We're looking at half a dozen, maybe more. Half a dozen. Oh, this is not. You don't get food, but you have a mission. You, newcomer, I need help. Okay. What's the matter? It's my assistant. She left to gather soil, and I've seen nothing of her since. Oh no. I cannot concentrate one whit for fear of what might have happened. Please, I beg of you. Will you go and check? I have to know. I mean, the newcomer is. They gotta right, prove go. their worth. Marvelous. Thank you. You'll be rewarded for your time, of course. Whereabouts is she? Gotan's Bales. It's on the outskirts of Lostwig. Not the safest place for an unaccompanied yeah, 40 bear, tasks. Perhaps, <laughs> but the soil there is second yeah. to none. Now go, and do not linger. Why, it may already be too late. It's like, why didn't you go, sir? It's such a concern. Dodge the chicken. Like some food. Back so soon? Fancied another kip in the cells, did you? Can they send me? He thought you might be hungry. Yeah, I'm thanking you for standing guard over me. Don't you feel bad now for insulting me? He wasn't wrong. The way my gut's been growling, I'd have curls running scared. <laughs> guard duty down here can't be much fun. It's not. But sometimes folk need locking up, and someone has to watch over them. I help people sleep at night, and that's not a boast many can make. You keep yourself on the right side of these bars now, you hear me? Yeah, it's all about perspective. Isn't Oi. it? Who did you bend over for to get the royal pardon? The old jailer there? <laughs> or was it Sid? Hey, background. Fish! We have seen fish in this game, and they were swimming in a pond. Oh, <gasps> mm, something smells good. For me, I hope. It is. Courtesy of Kenneth. Oh, my thanks. These birds are needy creatures. They don't like me running off to the fat chocobo behind their backs. <laughs> they must keep you busy. Ah, there's never a moment's rest. Probably for the best I eat down here, reeking of the staples as I do. I'd only put people off their food. And who has time to wash and dress for dinner when they've got little darlings like these to wait upon, eh? Anyway, thanks for the food, and be sure to give Kenneth my regards. You're welcome. The first mission we were just a waiter, now we're heckin' uber food. Give for some wild 
Uber Eats, that's what it's called. Can I help you? Never ordered from Get that. Get it sent to me. Slips him a bowl. <laughs> ah, wonderful. Do you hear that? Our food has arrived. Does your appetite still elude you? Is he sick? <sighs> I'm afraid so. Those no longer in need of a physica's immediate ministrations are sent here for further rest. I tend to those who cannot tend to themselves, which leaves me very little time for anything else. Happily, Kenneth sees that sure, I Sure, it's a thankless fed. job, too. I would be lost without the kindness of good people like him and yourself. Thank you. Kenneth that's knows that Clive just needs like purpose. So it was giving him some to do. Because Clive's all sad. Sad Clive is sad. Flashbang. Okay. I'm just seeing if there's something new. Moogle. <laughs> they even have a Moogle. I've never seen one in the flesh. There's a fuzzy. Well, here I am, so drink it in. I'm sure it's said in my father's bestiary that they live deep in the forest. And that they never reveal themselves to humans. He knows this stuff, but what he doesn't know is that Nectar the Nectar, Bold... Say. I didn't read the rest. Clive. Mugletong Koopa. So it would seem... I've been trying to talk to these people ever since the wind scared me here, but none of them understand what I say. I've been banging my pom pom against the wall. Painful. But now you hear my pom pom save your last. You can hear me. You can actually hear me. Cobal. And then I left. Oh, it's a secret too? Okay. Ah, you're back. All done? Wonderful. Here, your reward. As promised. The hideaway is quite something. Everyone has their place. A fact we are proud of, believe me. I'm glad you've witnessed it for yourself. You have your place too, of course. My squeaks, as yeah. <laughs> just so capably proven. And you will always have a place with us, should you desire it. It's kind of you to say so. It is the truth. And not a soul among us would deny it. I look forward to all that you will bring to our little community. Quest complete. Got some experience, got some money. You got a good guild bug. Wait, what is this? Is this money? I don't know what that is. Um. Okay. Let's search for the assistant. And let's stock up on potions first. That's something I didn't do last time. Yes. What? What? If you're gonna buy some, it'll be quick about it. What? Potion. Yeah, I have no potions. Sure. Well, let's not be greedy now. You'll not find a better price than that. It's better I'll be here. Alright. Um, do I do... You do map, right? And then... Nearby activities. No. Oh, I have to... Okay, here we go. Travel! What if the chocobos had voice acting, though? That's a different game. <laughs> See, we go. Someone's in trouble. Dun, 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 dun. Clive to save the day from the scooters. Thank <laughs> you. 
I need to remember controls. Yeah. That's enough. Spoil me. It would have been worse if you hadn't come along. Wait, uh, that means yes. I've seen you around the hideaway. You're new, aren't you? I'm Clive. And I'm <clears throat> Martel. But what are you doing My here? My name's not new. Looking for you. This is no place for a bearer on her own. I noticed that. But this soil's not going to collect itself. Then what if I gathered it for you? You could head back to the hideaway. Just exactly what sort of dirt is it that you need? What I need is soil. But I'd be a fool to refuse your help after what just happened. It's the good stuff you're looking for. Dark, rich, fragrant. You'll know it when you find it. Dark, rich, and fragrant. Right. Well, you should hurry back. Bohemil seemed worried enough that he might come looking for you himself. That seems unlikely, but I won't argue with you. Thanks. Thanks. Soil then. There's certainly enough of it here. But is it dark, rich, and fragrant? I'm just gonna steal from these grapes. <laughs> Get them all. That should be enough. I better get it back to the hideaway. But I want to look up at that house. Yeah, I just stole a bunch of your soil, and you got a spider problem. No one seems to care, though. To kill. Want to go up to the vineyard where they smash the grapes? Is it where anything comes from? No, meaning portion of food. Ah, interesting. Since Master Quinton took over, we've not lost a single vine to black rot or downy mold. Wow. Here's the wine press. Squeezed. Doggo's like, yo, purple drink. Poor goal. Yum. Alright, I guess we just head back then, huh? Quite the vineyard. I suppose I could just do it on the map, but... Let's see what happens if I walk there. Oh, it's just the teleport stone, isn't it? It's not like these worlds are connected. I guess I just leave. Can I do this? What happens when I do this? There's a boundary line that started in Final Fantasy 11. 12? 12. 11 was the first MMO, wasn't it? Yeah, we found your apprentice or whatever. There you are. And all safe and sound. Yes, she's standing right there. 
Not the girl. The soil. Whoa. Did you bring it? Uh, yes. Here. Well, to be fair, he already knew the girl was safe, I guess. Glorious! When Martel came home empty-handed, I almost had a fit. But with this, with this, my research can continue. First and foremost come the measurements. I must know how much ether each sample contains. From there... Wait, so you were never... Worried about me? Sorry to disappoint you, but the only thing he worries about is his research. But that's... It's all right. It's just how he is. And if it wasn't for him, we wouldn't be growing anything in these ruins. It's a small price to pay. Although you shouldn't have to pay it too. I right, take it easy, Rodian. you anything for helping? Thanks for coming in. Ugh. Here. I know it's not much, but it's something at least. We need apple. I could offer you some fruit too, but you're not likely to thank me if I do. Still. We'll grow something worth eating one of these days, and when we do, you'll have first pick. Are you saying the fruit's not good now? Man, oh, that's a lot of valley matter. Cheers. All right, continue the main story. Really do with a proper place and free. What's up, Gav? So your mind's made up, is it? We'll be leaving for Rosaria as soon as we're able. Back down memory lane, eh? Rosaria ain't what she used to be, Clive. And not since the Imperials moved in. First sign of trouble, you make straight for Martha's rest and ask for the landlady. She's yeah. a friend of the cause. Tell her you was Sid, and she'll help you out. Understood. Oh, thank you, Gav. Yeah. I'll be lost without you. Yeah, I'm just doing my job. No need to make such a fuss. One likes making Gav uncomfortable. You take care, all right? Oh, I'm crap at goodbyes. Where's Sid when you need him? Give him my regards when he gets back. I will. Let's do it, Jill. Sorry to keep you waiting. Ready, my lady. <laughs> Calm ready. down, Clive. Deep breaths. Here's one thing that's kind of a bummer about this game is you're just controlling Clive. Everyone else is just kind of like a guest. Even though, like, I don't know, equipment management isn't too intense in Final Fantasy games, anyway. Oh, the countryside so green. Rosaria, it's been thirteen years. Do so you have counter? Kind of. It's just as I remember it. You have like a you parry and dodge counter. I couldn't. Bran did keep a close watch on each other in the Imperial Army. You'd get beheaded just for knowing a deserter. The only way out was on a mission. I see. But mostly I was afraid. Afraid to go back. I know. Also, but I'm here now. at some point in this game, there's supposed to be some um, plot twist that I remember a bunch of people saying caught them off guard. Thanks to you. 
and I'm I'm not seeing it right now, so. We should press on. We're kind of getting amongst it. Homecoming. That's in at the top of the hill must be Martha's rest. Gav said the landlady's a friend. But can we say the same for her patrons? Imperials don't tend to take well to those with my mark. If anyone asks, I'm a branded soldier, sworn to protect my noble mistress. The mistress. Are we going to fight the bugs in the bog? Yeah, why don't you walk on the the cobblestone, not in the bushes? Look at the fuse on this one. Explains why there's a premium on Imperials. Maybe I should up your rations, build you up a bit. <gasps> there's a dog to pet down here. Pet the dog. Oh no. Not for petting. Wrong button. Sick charge. Whoa. Get over here. Waterfall. Oh, Jill is a party member now. She looks very blue magey, but um, also uh, Shiva, I guess. Where's the fish? There's no fish in this waterfall pool. I see dangerous plants. Barking Torgal. Are they frogs? No frogs.
More crabbers. We're just taking out the local wildlife, it's fine. Gotta do the attack game. Gotta get all the experience. <gasps> what is this? Clam shells. Where where the fish? There's no fish. I cry. Jill, where have you done with the fish? Jarbos! But what's on this side of the road? <gasps> the fish? <gasps> I thought it's that one, but it wasn't. <gasps> There's the fish! I see two of them! Fish! Fish! But how do I catch the fish? <laughs> do a double jump. Who are these friends? Oh, not friends. Stay down. Th those weren't friendly in Cherno. What's this away? Muck Pond. I'm gonna find another Marlboro Birdies. Hey, Birdies. It's a tarp! Worth it for the level up. Hello, birds. Bear, there's birds. I have no fear. Wait a second. You can normal day. You're a fine hound. Okay. Um. What was that? Abilities. 866. I wanted to get this. Because it looked cool. Uh, one of these was like a counter. No, I wanted this. Wicked wheel. Kind of don't like that attack. Get this one instead. Okay. Yeah. 200 shirt. Get rid of the ability points. So now I need to equip that. This one? Yeah, I don't like this one. Give it to the Rook's Gambit, please. Alright.
Three chunks. Why right? I feel like I'll be coming back here for a side mission because this feels very arena like. And that's okay. It's right now. There's exclamation. They never finished building the bridge then. After what happened at Phoenix Gate, it didn't seem the highest priority. Oh no, the cart is overturned and the chocobos are laughing at it. Work, work. Oi! Stop and give me an hand. Alright, Rowan. Here, you couldn't give me an hand, could you? Typical. A bloody bearer. Just when I thought my luck had changed. Well, now I'm not going to give you a hand. Still, better a crumb of crystal than an empty hand, I suppose. Though it pains me to use another man's branded. Here, you understand me, don't you? <laughs> I need your help. These blasted birds must have caught whiff of my cargo, and now they've got me surrounded. And it was running late as it was. I've got something special needs delivering before the rest. But I dare not leave my cart untended. You couldn't run it up to Martha's rest for me, could you? Needs to get there a quick mind. I'm headed there anyway. That's the spirit. All right. Here. You hand that to the stable master and no one else. I'm owed a little something for it. If he gives it to you, pass it along to your master by way of thanks. Be off with you then. And don't go taking any detours on the way. I'm taking every detour. What a bird wants. What a bird needs. Whatever makes me find the fish in the water. And I'm dashing forward. I don't know. And knowing exactly... Killer B. Magical B. Don't let them get away. <laughs> More blue shiny. Oh, there's a big boy over there. One another dog to pet. the death cry. Be 
we're doing it. We're doing all the things. All right, big boy. Guard in the chest. Get him. Go this time. I thought I had that dodged, I did not. Ten chunks. It's like a lot of chunks. Where the fish? No fish. No fish. All right. We made it. rest <gasps> but there's stuff over here don't let them get away it's over <laughs> curb stomp the bee that's the way to do it Five gill, but more importantly, a direction over here. Murder by the shack. Ooh, gold. Why was that gold? They were keeping their bloody hides here. You guys are gonna be pissed. I took every detour, like I said I was gonna do. There's one more shiny over here. Stay down. 
It's over. I mean, I got like half a level from fighting all these things, so... I guess it's worth it. I don't know. Also, there's more, I guess. Keep your distance, boy. Stay down. Nice miss. Punishing sick. How to get over there? Need a boat. I guess that's it. Now we could go up this way, I guess. Let's just go through the front door. Those guards up front are gonna be like, no, you're not allowed, and then I'm just gonna have to come back down here. Water. That's one of our branded. Do we take him in? He's not one of ours. Look, it's with his master. <gasps> our deception is working. Stable master, I was asked to deliver this to you. This is for me, right enough. Not sure what some bearer is doing bringing it to me, though. Where's that fool of a peddler got to? He couldn't come himself. His cart surrounded by wild chocobos. Hmm. Huh. Sounds about right. He'll have it full of geese, old beans, no oh. doubt. Fair enough. Crammed with him, if I know him. Gizelle Greens. Chocobos go mad for <gasps> the Chocobos. And if you forget to seal the car up tight, the smell gets out, and birds come running from miles around. Don't get me wrong. They're a fine investment for a savvy merchant, especially around these parts. But you can't get greedy, as our mutual friend is learning the hard way. Ha ha ha. I got my wares, and that's all that matters. Be sure to pass your master my regards. Quest did complete. Amazing. I guess it was worth it. I don't know. Good girl. You get some rest. You barely have to step out your front door these days before you're set. All right, ready for Martha's rest. I wonder if Martha is as friendly as Gav claims. Let's go and find out, shall we? Shall we? Which stuff was for the Golden Stables again? Very good to East Pool, leave him in the park. Ah, oh, activate the stone. Here, has this thing always been glowing? Nope, just since I arrived. Oh yeah, their wells are fun. So much for all parts of the Empire being equal, if that's all the crystal they give us. Oh, it's not like any of us. That is a bowl of brown. There is one missing. Cabbages. One chicken is gone. Oh no. This is a cool town. Treasure. Uh, orchestra roll. Worth. The bridge will be fixed when it's fixed, alright? But I was supposed to be in East Pool yesterday. 
Not my problem. Music's pretty chill. Pull that sword from its scab. Wait. Excuse me? If it weren't for that mark, I'd be on you like a rash. <laughs> okay. Goblin coin. <gasps> Farmer's market. Oh! Fish! We found why the reason why there's no fish, fish there, son. in the water. Keep them nice and fresh. Ooh, I see fish. Look at all these greens. Mushrooms. We drove past the farmer's market today. That looks like kohlrabi. I was, uh, it's the new crop. we were tempted to stop, but we did not. Mostly because parking looked like a nightmare. Meat! Me to Martha's. Are you Martha? Dang, quite the building you got going on here. Peruse, undressing greens of Gishal. Gisol. Martha Brooks, no sharps. The following cheatery will be repaid with soup, boot in the arse, mucking, stacking, packing, peeking, palming, foisting, and fingering. None of that. What's up, Martha? Excuse me. Would you happen to be the landlady? Depends who's asking. And why they have an imperial bearer with them. For protection, which hopefully won't be needed, if you can advise me on the safest route to the west. It's your friend here I'd be worried about. Bearers don't have an easy time of it in Rosaria. Even a Stratton lad like him might attract the wrong kind of attention. And if he gets nabbed, it ain't likely to end well for you either. Then we'll just have to stay out of the malicious way. Gav said you might be able to help us. Follow me. Mm. Gav. Sorry for before. Can't be too wary of strangers asking questions in our game. I'm Martha, an old friend of Sid's. He said he had high hopes for a bearer who joined recently. I expect that's you. So, where is it you're headed? For Phoenix Gate. We have questions that need answering. Is that so? Well, if you want to avoid the garrison, the road through Eastpool's your best bet. Or it would be, if the bridge hadn't collapsed. Sure, we can like jump it. it is. We've had no trade with the village for weeks. I did ask our carpenter to take a look at it. But he went out on another job. And he hasn't come back. Do you think something might have happened to him? Fingers crossed he's just taking his time. The alternative don't bear thinking about. We'll find him. And make sure he's safe. We both need that bridge repaired. And your carpenter sounds like the man to do it. I see why Sid's got such a soft spot for you. If you could, I'd be in your debt. You said that he went out on a job? Right. 
He went down into the marshes to check on another bridge, the one by the Fallen Gate. The marshes were dangerous at the best of times. We should hurry. There's a ladder to the side of the gate. That's the quickest way down, if you've a head for heights. His name is Bernard. Should you find Bernard. him well, tell him Martha sent you, and that he's wanted at the bridge to Eastpool. All right. Bernard. To the marshes, then. Let's find that ladder. It was good, honest. Cool. There's a ladder. Here's the gate. And that must be the ladder. How does Doggo go down the ladder? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't care what your orders are, Brandon. You keep them. Get away from me! Oh no. What was that? It came from under the bridge. Let's see. Come on. We're here to help. There he is. Hold on, we're coming. It's over. Those things are like gigantic. They could feed the whole town. Thank you, my lady. You saved my life. Not at all. You're Bernard the carpenter, yes? I am. I, I didn't realize my name was known so widely. I'm a friend of Martha's. She asked us to come and find you. Well, I'm very grateful for it. I just finished checking these piles when I turn around, I see a gang of slavering monsters looking to, to feast on my flesh. <laughs> if you hadn't come when you did, I'd have been snipped into strips by now. We're just glad you're safe. Well, I, I best go and give my regards to the landlady then, hey? Actually, she asked that if we found you, we should beg you make haste to repair the bridge to Eastpool. Of course. I, I said I'd take a look at it, but it, it clean slipped my mind. I'll head up there straight away. Please just teleport me back. Okay, good. All right, the trusses are still sturdy. It's just a matter of replacing the stringers and relining the deck. I'll have it done in no time. Thank you, Bernard. We were hoping to take the road to Eastpool ourselves. We're very grateful for your help. And sorry for asking this of you after what you've been through. I owe you my life. Fixing a bridge is the least I can do. Thank you, my lady. And you too, son. You're with Sid, ain't ya? Me and him will go way back. Not as far as Martha mine, but far enough. Fair see. enough. Well, I best get cracking then. You go and let Martha know I'm all right, and she'll have her bridge back soon enough. We will. The bridge will be fixed when it's fixed. We did it. We did the fetch quest. Oh, the levers that you Do you like that? There's plenty more of that. We did the deed. Ah, you're back. What happened? Did you find Bernard? We did. He's fine. And he'll have the bridge to Eastpool repaired soon. Oh, well, thank the founder for that. It was lucky we found him when we did. The creatures out there are not to be trifled with. It's the Blight's fault. They have nothing to eat in the north, so they come down here hunting for food. He can't keep going out alone. I'll have to arrange a guard for him. 
But anyway, thank you. I don't have a lot to offer in return, but you're welcome to rest here until the repairs are finished. We'd be delighted. Huh? There's a lot of downtime in this game, but it's fine. It's kind of the reason I'm enjoying playing it, because I can just sit and watch, too. Can I get you a drink or anything while yes. you wait? Yes. Flagon of Imperial Gold, uh, perhaps? Sioux City, Sass Parilla. Slake of thirst. No, thank you. I prefer the truth about why there are so few bearers around here. Yes. There were more of them when we were young. Far more. Is this the Empire's doing? Have they been sent away? They have, aye. Either to the Legions or Auriflam. Seems the miners at Drake's Head are having a hard time keeping up with demand of late. So the bearers make up the shortfall. Time was, they used to dole out crystals like sugar plums, even down here in the provinces, but not anymore. Nowadays, they'll jump at any excuse to confiscate our bearers so they can be put to work elsewhere. I always knew the Empire treated their branded like shit, but after seeing it with my own eyes, well... Who this? Congratulations on the new arrival. And you got a little laddie with you? It was a bearer. The boy I carried for nine long moons. A bloody bearer. Oh, you poor thing. You gave it to the constables then. Just left it at the garrison, I Let them deal with it. What? Couldn't wait to be rid of the blasted thing. Been wanting it gone since the moment I found out. Well, it's all dealt with now. So no harm done, eh? Mum, you weren't my brother, was he? No. But you'll have one soon enough. You just have to be patient. All right? All right. What? Unbelievable, isn't it? Bearers may have been looked down on back in Archduke Elwyn's day, but they were still human beings. No. Wait, what's a bear? Isn't it just one with the mark? Person is... Oh, power to cast magic. Okay. Without decreased stone. That's my next guess. Fallen so far, a beggar wouldn't spit on him. Since you're not drinking... Do me a favor and take that to the Abbey. There's a darkness, the heart of this world, and I'd have you see it. So, magic users are super and hated. We'll see it at an Abbey. But Glademond Abbey, on the shore. They're of also Sunrise the Bay. king and the emperor. Abbey, yeah, <laughs> friend. Yeah. Tell him Martha sent you, and he'll show you what I mean. Understood. That's like far away. Oh, you got stuff? What are you after? What e what? E what e what? I got all this stuff already. My guy. Don't have that. Those things are expensive. Steel. I got some gill bugs, don't I? Using crafting, using crafting, using crafting. Valuable gill bug. Is that everything? Valuable can be traded for gill. A thick oily substance sometimes found pooling in newly formed wounds in the earth. What's oh, oil? Um, uh, right. Uh, crystal the liquid has until recently been largely ignored by the people. Can be traded for gill. I wanted one of those. Economists aren't want to argue the currency-based commerce is a cornerstone of civilization. If true, the coin was just that goblins are far more civilized than humankind. 
Yeah, I like how the goblins are all like whisper, whisper, whisper. A fair trade. Using crafting, 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 crafting. Craft, craft, craft. Okay. Take care out there, eh? All right, cheers, boy. Where'd you get these turnips? Jab, lab, lab, lab. Here we go. Elevator down. Hit the dog while we. Okay, I guess can. I knew that children were tested. That a bearer's fate was decided at birth. And assumed it was best for all concerned. I know. But for a child to be blamed. To be hated by its parents through no fault of its own. Yo, is that like a blue chocobo? Did we? What the blue chocobo? Give them all you've got, Roy. I wanted to grab the bug above me, but okay. I missed like all of these attacks. It's over. Don't let them get away. See the blue chocobo. Does it cross rivers? Bluebird. Are you not the chocobo? Hi. No. Where are these? Ah. Wow. Killing chocobos. Fe feels bad, man. I'm going the wrong way. I'm just kind of seeing things to fight and I'm going to go fight them. Get him, doggo. 
I thought I dodged that. Apparently not. Can't dodge that? I don't know. I don't know. Um, I feel like the camera should pull back just a little bit when you're fighting. I feel like it did that in 7 Remake. Or is just you are able to switch between characters so you could like jump around and get a little bit better sense of the battlefield. Because here it's just like a bunch of indicators. Chocobos again. There'll be no chocobos around here. There's the Abbey. What darkness awaits us within, I wonder. Let's go and see. Keep your distance, boy. Stay down. Nice. That's a full heal, too, which is helpful. Found a cemetery. I'll have to come back here at night to kill a ghost. Where are the fish? They're all at the food market. through all these. Kill the chocobo, kill the chocobo. 
Heck, the Abbey, I'm just like running around again. All the gubbins. Nice. Goblin coin and a bunch of stuff. Speaking of stuff, it's over here. Local map. I guess I should go to the. Well, there's items. So we spent all this time with Jill and we haven't stolen her powers yet, so. Oh. It is the dog. Pet the dog. But what was it defending? Anything? Just the bridge being a dog. Team Spongy. Um. I think it's just the game being here, use your abilities. Um, that was more so of a uh, tank your enemy, that's for true though. Oops, I've been bubbled. 
I mean, I'm not like taking That's damage enough. at all, but um, I think I'm two levels higher than these enemies are. Yeah. I think they just want want you to be able to like use your weapons and or abilities and stuff. Which I'm not using, I'm like just spamming square. <gasps> Another dog. Get him. Steal his lunch first. You know what to do. You got this time. Like some enemies are meant to be fought a little more than other ones, it seems. Like they have a bigger stagger gauge. This guy's weak to fire. We did it. We killed the dog. Got more black blood, which is sounds like oil, but all right. Should we head to the abbey? I guess. Nope. There's stuff over here. There's there's stuff everywhere. <laughs> Did I get this stuff? I don't know. I'm just killing things. Alright, let's go to the Abbey. I'm assuming enemies don't respawn. Because <laughs> if they do, we got a whole bunch more to fight through. Doesn't look like it. We've called the uh, local wildlife. To you. I saw I'm you the murder Abbey everything. Is not open for public prayer. May Grieger go with you. We came to offer a donation from Martha. <sighs> uh. 
I see. Here's a little crystal holster. Then please, follow me. I... I don't want to die. Breathless bear. Please, father. Mm. Help me for the pain. I'll beg you. The light, it fades. I don't want to die alone. It's all right. I'm here. Who are these people? Martha's bearers. She entrusted them to my care. ...that I might ease their suffering. To the extent that I can... ...for the time they have left. Okay. What happened to them? The hand looks frozen. has taken them. All of them. As it does every bearer forced to use their gift. With each draw on the ether, their bodies petrify, till all that remains is stone mm. and pain, and so they are cast aside. Well, I've been using a lot of there that. There is nothing <laughs> either Martha or I can do to change that. But we can at least strive to make their final hours a little more bearable. <laughs> Have faith, my son, for you shall rise again and find the happiness denied you in this life. Thank you. I must offer you my own thanks for the medicine you so kindly brought. Ah, their final moments may be moments of peace. Should have had a drink instead, I guess. When next you see Martha, pray tell her that two more have succumbed. Heavy sigh. We should get back to Martha's rest. Yes, we should. Hi. Thank you for bringing us the physic. Would that we were not so reliant on Martha's kindness. What's in here? Give me all you got. Smash the pots. No nothing's in here. Why, why did you let me come in here? She's like, Lamau, they went through the open door. Morons. So did that respond? Oh! Ten pinches of magic ash. How much do you reckon a pinch is? Did that respawn the enemies? So I gotta fight everything on the way back now? Great. Let's make this quick. Yeah. That's enough. You missed, Jill. Yeah. 
Maybe just one set. Doesn't look like there's much else. See, I actually cleared out all the enemies to run back already. I'm doing it out of order, in order. Elevator, please. This seems like it should be used for more than just three people. Sounder worthy. It mentions fish. We did your dumb fetch quest. <laughs> ah, you're back. Thanks for taking care of that. The abbot had a message for you. Two more have succumbed. I see. Come upstairs. Okay. Where I may speak on private. At the top of the stairs. So, now you know, eh? I've seen plenty of bearers die on the battle. I don't know. Um, maybe. But never like that. And all because they were born different. The powers She's got a cool outfit. So they strip and weapon and stuff. Instead. So that's fun. Oh, there's plenty who pity a bearer's plight. But so long as we're content to sit around, weeping for those on whose broken backs we're carried. So we far, it just seems nothing. like they're childhood friends reunited. You lend Sid your strength. What little of it I have. Used profits from this place to buy the poor buggers. So when the abbot told us the bearers were yours. Aye. They're my property, at least by law. Any still fit to work fetch a price beyond my means. All I can do is care for those who are past mending. But it's not all doom and gloom. Bernard's finished fixing that bridge for you. You can Bernard's. carry on to Eastpool now. You've got questions that need answering, ain't you? Well, I wish you luck. Thank you, Martha. Oh, I almost forgot. Sid and I have other friends in Rosaria. Wear this and they'll know you for one of us. Mm, the seal. Slumbering Chuckaba. And know that you will always be welcome here. I, I made some Chuckabos slumber forever on my way to your fetch quest. You were right, Sid. It really is them. Lord Rosfield and Lady Warwick have come back to us. And long may they stay. Mm. So, the locals remember them. That's interesting, I guess. Flame a mom. We should think about pressing on. I can't be seen talking to you. If there's anything you need, ask Martha. Okay, why can't? Oh, because I'm branded, probably. <gasps> Jill, what's up? If this were Baldur's Gate, I could talk to you. I played a little bit of that again this morning, and it's fun. I'm enjoying it more. It's starting. Combat's starting to make more sense to me. Uh, we're going to end it here for now. Um... We may be back later tonight. Maybe. Depends how we're feeling. If we are, it'll be uh, more of this. Well, thanks for coming out, everyone. We had fun playing uh, The Expanse again. I'm excited to play more Telltale stuff. And, uh... Yeah, we got... Unavowed to play... Actually, I was actually thinking about playing that today or starting it, but then I remembered I had um, the expanse to finish. 
and I wanted to do some more 16. I don't, 16's feeling weird. Um, I mean, like, I'm enjoying the, the world of it. And the combat's fun from time to time, but, like, that whole area felt not great. <laughs> Just, like, everything felt a little too gimme-ish. Um, so I guess I'm just waiting for it to pick up a little bit. But I don't know. I do like a Final Fantasy. The, the whole time I'm just thinking like... I, I was having for more fun with Remake, but I don't know. Maybe 